YouTube, it's Matt here. Today is going to be my first episode of the Top 5 Apps uh, series. So basically what this is going to be is I'm going to say all my Top 5 Apps in each category. So right now I'm going to go over the utilities and I'm going to do probably uh, video and pictures editing software. Uh, the Top 5 for that or uh, the Top 5 in multimedia apps like players or uh, things like that. Uh, my top five in customizations apps so uh, Mac uh, the best apps for Mac customization and probably also the top five games uh, I think but that's gonna be like later on because it's harder to get games than apps um, obviously so right now I'm gonna go over the utilities so the first app I want to show you guys is Junkut so uh, Junkut is actually quite simple basically it lets you paste the last 50 things you copied. So right now I can open up a text edit document. I'm gonna make it a little bigger here for you guys. So right now I can just copy something like hello and then here I'm gonna say uh, my name is Hugo. Okay, Ooh, sorry about that. Hugo. Okay, so basically I've got two things here. For example, I have copied this, so my name is Hugo, and then I've copied hello. This is just an example. Well, of course, this can be anything, text, pictures, whatever you want. Uh, so, and then uh, I want to paste something else, but I want to paste not the hello, which I uh, copy last, but I want to paste this. So basically, what I just do is go to Jump Cut, which is right here in my menu bar, and then I just click here, my name is you, so I can just repaste that. And like uh, this, you can do with the last 50 things you copy. So I think that's a really cool application. Uh, because it's like really handy so uh, all the links will be in the description by the way uh, jump cut right here so these links will be in the description guys so uh, that's it for jump cut then the second thing is drop zone uh, drop zone is quite handy because it can do a lot of different stuff so basically this is the icon for drop zone uh, you've got I've got like eight things here but you can add more and you can download them from your website so it's quite simple here you've got some options uh, zip and email, share text, install application, tweet pick, uh, tweet, tweet, tweet doc, image check, and Dropbox and zip file. So basically, these are all actions you can do. So for example, you can drag and drop an image and put it in uh, tweet pick. So I'm just going to show you right now. So right now, I've got here an image, whatever image, random image. I go on drop zone, I go on tweet pick, and it's automatically it's going to upload the image. So right now I cancelled obviously. And for example, I've got this song here. I wanna art archive it, zip it. I just go to here, zip file, and it's automatically gonna ask me which name I want. So I'm gonna say song. And it's automatically going to say zip create it and then you're done. So I think that's quite cool. But there are a lot of different things. So you can upload to image check, a zip and email, share text, Dropbox, some of you guys. Uh, use Dropbox probably uh, I think it's quite cool and then you can even add here add is on automatically uh, if you go to the website of Dropbox you can add uh, modules so basically you can add like different stuff like I want something for uh, Flickr so you, you also got Flickr uh, that kind of stuff so you can say the action so Flickr upload move files, open application, save text. For example, I have Flickr upload and then I name it Flipper upload and then I want to get icon so I just get the icon, Flickr upload and then I say add. Oh yeah and then you have to obviously authorize Flickr to uh, uh, access your computer and then you can just drag and drop a picture and automatically uh, uploads it to Flickr. So I think that's quite cool guys. Uh, so then the third thing, third thing, I actually got six things, but that's because one is not really like it's really short. Uh, so the th uh, third thing is AT Monitor. So I think that's a uh, if you know iStat menu, basically it's the same, but I think it's a little better. Uh, so you've got a few things you got here in the menu bar, you can see your CPU, your RAM, your hard disk drive, how much is copied, and all that stuff, and your net um, connection. And you can even, if you go to the preferences right here, I can show this. So this is the acti activity monitor, and here you can see the frames per second, GPU, RAM, uh, CPU 1, 
uh, whatever. I mean, all the information you need to know. So that's quite cool. Um, and this is just a widget. It's not a widget because it's not on your dashboard, but you can still like use it, uh, just like that. So that's for AD monitor. Again, all the links will be in the description to the right. Uh, then I've got Flip for Mac, which is well, you cannot. It's not really an app that's running, but it's a kind of a plugin for a QuickTime player, and basically it lets you. Um, I'm gonna start like this. Flip for probably so this is flip for Mac and what it lets you do is when you go to QuickTime normally uh, you cannot play WMV files and with flip for Mac it adds that to a QuickTime player so you can uh, read WMV files so then the fourth fifth thing sorry fifth thing I want to show you is I free mem so I used it a lot uh, I use this a lot especially when I go play some games and I've got some other applications running. So for example I've got Skype because I'm calling someone and I'm at the same time I'm playing but I also want my browser in case I want to share something I'm basically always got my browser on and here basically it's gonna show you the free RAM you still got the inactive, the wired and the active and the most interesting part is the optimized memory so I'm not gonna do that right now because otherwise it's gonna lag a lot but basically it saves you a lot of free um, free RAM so for example I've got uh, 1800 MB of RAM about and I do optimize memory and I'll probably have 2000 something so I save a lot of RAM I think that's really handy for if you want to play games and all that stuff so the sixth thing I wanted to show you which it, it's the top five but I still want to show you this is a uh, one password basically it saves all your passwords from all your website websites so I think that's also a very nice utility you can sync it with your palm and your iPhone and I really like this. You can lock it, and then you only got one master password and for all your passwords. So I think that's quite cool. And the cool thing about one password is that once you go on a website, whatever website you have an account on, there's this little. Well, this is not the official icon, but uh, this is like the one password icon, and it's a plugin in your browser. You can just restore form, and then it says no saved forms because I don't have an account on this page. But for example, if I go on YouTube it will automatically fill my username and password for you uh, which I think is really handy uh, sometimes to have that so uh, these were my top five well six but I didn't really count I free mem or flip for Mac because that was quite quick so that's why I did six in the place of uh, in replace of five um, so yeah that's it so oh yeah by the way I had a lot of questions uh, if I already had snow leopard or not I do not have Snow Leopard yet installed. Uh, I'm probably going to get it, but not right now. And I think there are a lot of applications which are not supported by uh, Snow Leopard yet. So I'll just wait like uh, maybe a month or maybe a hot two weeks or something before installing it. So to be sure that most of the apps do work on Snow Leopard. So that's to answer your question. And if you want this wallpaper, uh, I've got it somewhere. So I'll just upload it for you guys. Um, to somewhere I don't know but I'll put the link in the description with all the other links to the right so that's it I hope you like this video uh, please comment rate subscribe um, yeah comment tell me what you think your best uh, utility is on your Mac and or well, you can also of course put a video response to show us uh, what it exactly is so uh, yeah like I already said comment rate subscribe that's it for today see you later peace